Hi there, uh, my name is Jason Caldwell. I'm the lead developer for the S2 member plugin. Uh, I just received uh, uh, an email from Christian who pointed me to this uh, forum thread. And I w decided to go ahead and just do a video to cover uh, the answer to this question. This user is writing in and asking if it's possible to set up three different membership types all with free access. Is S2 member capable of that? And they go on to say they don't want to use PayPal in any way but they want to be able to do some different things here so they were going to need to break it down by level however if you've used S2 member the free version for any length of time uh, you've probably seen that S2 member designates level 0 for free access so anyone that comes in uh, after open registration is enabled uh, they sign up for free but they always come in at level 0 and then levels 1 through 4 are designed for paid access so S2 member just assumes that anyone that's coming in at one of the levels, 1, 2, 3, or 4, are going to be paying. Unfortunately, in the free version of S2 member, uh, what they're asking for is not, uh, is not uh, possible yet. However, it is possible with S2 member Pro. So I'm going to show you that real quick here. I'm going to switch tabs. I have uh, an installation of WordPress here with the S2 member Pro module installed. And Although this user does not want to use PayPal in any way, and they don't have to to accomplish this, uh, the uh, free registration form, the short code that they'll need, is actually built into the PayPal Pro form system that comes with S2 Member Pro. So you can use this particular aspect of the Pro form integration without actually having a PayPal Pro account or even having to configure the PayPal options for that matter. Uh, just coming in here to this section, and we can take this short code that's made available underneath this free, you'll find it right here, second panel down, free registration forms. And then by default, it just says one form does it all because S2 member assumes that anyone coming in uh, that's going to be a free subscriber will be at level zero. But then it goes on to say that some of these attributes can be changed. So that's what I want to show you here. We can take this short code, I'm going to copy it, and then I'm going to open another window here. This is just a text editor. I'm going to paste it right in here and let's take a look at it. Okay, so the first part of the short code here is just saying, okay, this is a pro form and then it's a registration form. So we can leave all of this just like it is and then right here you'll see there's a level attribute. Okay, so this is where uh, when you paste this short code into a post or a page, it's going to produce a form that allows people to sign up for free. So it, by default, they'll come in at level zero, but we can change this. We can create another version of this and change it to one. Or we can create another version and change it to two. So each time pasting this short code into a different page, thereby creating a different sign-up form. So you could do level three and level four, and that way you cover all five different levels and, and you have the ability for all of those, cu those customers to come in at no charge without having to go through PayPal or anything like that. Now there's another way you could do this, and that is to leave this set at level zero. So everyone comes in with, with the subscriber role, and then you can break apart uh, the different uh, features that you want to offer based on what would have been levels, but you can do that with custom capabilities instead. That's what this CCAPS attribute allows you to do. So here we could type in, we could have a level zero, and then we could do another variation where we still provide level zero access, but instead of just the standard free version or free account, you would get a free account that might come with the capability of having access to music. Or we might do another variation that includes music and videos. Or another variation includes music, videos, and a gift. Or you might have another one that just has a gift. So there's, you, you can do an unlimited number of things here with this custom capabilities. And if you're not familiar uh, with how custom capabilities work, uh, if you go to s2member.com, uh, up, in the, up on the top right hand corner you'll find a, a button that says video tutorials and I've done another lengthy video there that covers custom capabilities in detail uh, even showing you how to uh, implement them uh, into a theme in more creative ways. Okay so this is how you would accomplish having a free registration form at multiple levels or even with different custom capability packages. There's some other attributes in this shortcut as well and you'll find the documentation on these. I'm going to switch screens again. You'll find the documentation on these all the way at, bo all the way at the bottom of this PayPal Pro Form section. And this is where you'll see how these other attributes work and, and uh, some of the possible values that they can have. 
Okay, and again, you can do this without having uh, to configure your PayPal options. This particular form, uh, because it does not include any payment processing, uh, it's incorporated as part of the pro forms for PayPal integration, but it can be used without actually integrating with PayPal. All right, so thank you for a great question, and uh, thank you, Christian, for uh, pointing this out to me.